Hey, it's Scott Brown from Connie and Dick Service Center in Claremont, California. Wanted to give a shout out uh, to a few tools that uh, helped us get to the bottom of a uh, intermittent P0299 un- turbo under boost code on a 2014 Chevrolet Cruze. And uh, this uh, first, we were using the HP tuners uh, to log data because I, I love the way that uh, this thing can display data. And as you can see, that we you can you can see the desired boost and under boost. And we use the red line uh, high pressure turbo testing equipment to help identify an inlet tube that was uh, leaking at the clamp. So we corrected that. But uh, as subsequent runs, we can get this uh, underboost to, to reoccur. So we suspected that we had probably something going on with the wastegate uh, actuator or wastegate uh, valve. So we pulled the front bank one, center one, uh, O2 sensor out, and we inserted a uh, boroscope, uh, the snap-on unit, and then we used the a red line turbo boost um, tester to actuate the uh, wastegate so we could lift it off of its seat. And um, their quick connect unit actually made it kind of nice to do that. So as we're feeding the, um, uh, positioning the camera around, we can watch and uh, we can see that definitely the turbo has a large crack in it, but we're more concerned with the seat uh, were the seals because uh, it's intermittent. And so uh, I've got the, got the camera there and we're getting it positioned and it just takes a little bit of patience, but you can get it maneuvered around and uh, get a good shot. And you'll see that uh, we're able to uncover the fact that this seat or this crack is actually exposing a pretty good gap. And you see the gap there uh, showing up in the uh, in the image, so um, it's pretty awesome. You can take a couple of screenshots, you know, from the Snap-on tool and and uh, do it. But there's a really good shot of the wastegate uh, crack. So anyhow, uh, again, again, this is a little shout out to the Snap-on folks and the folks at Redline and also the folks at HP Tuners that makes it easy for us to. Um, gather data, analyze the data, do some inspections, and uh, move on to a diagnosis so we can get an estimate together. So thanks, and thanks for watching.